Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Matt Croissant at McCarthy Hyundai Blue Springs, Missouri, getting you some information on this 2016 Hyundai Tucson Limited. Coming in the ruby wine. You got a sporty, large 19-inch wheel set on here. Turn indicators on your mirrors. Keyless entry on your front two doors. Chrome accents on your door handles. Color matched mirrors. Nice brush aluminum rail system up above. Gonna get a power lift gate on this model. Backup camera. This is also equipped with your 1.6 liter turbo. Paired up to a seven speed automatic. Got some sharp looking LED taillights back here. Wish we could see those in the nighttime right now. Sharp looking ride for sure. This vehicle's got some awesome safety equipment, convenience features up front. You got some sharp looking LED daytime running lights down below. You got those projector beam headlights sitting there for you too. Nice looking ride. Let's go ahead and take a peek inside, see what all this vehicle has to offer to you. You got blind spot monitors on your mirrors here. Inside, to complement the ruby wine exterior, we've got a beige interior. Power locks, windows, and mirrors here for you. Driver window is automatic. Got some nice storage in the doors. And you have an eight-way adjustable power driver's seat with lumbar support. Fuel door release is down below here and just to the left on the dash. We've got dash illumination control, your blind spot monitoring, traction control, and your power lift gate option right there for you. Nice perforated leather right here with some nice bolstering. Taking a peek inside here, we've got a leather wrapped steering wheel here for you. You can unlock it on the left, move it up, down, in, and out, tilting and telescopic. You have entertainment controls on the left hand side here, audio sources, voice recognition, volume, tracks, presets, and your Bluetooth. And then on the right hand side, we're going to have your uh, driving and information tools such as your uh, page button here, and this little dial, and the OK button. On your first screen, it's going to show you trip information and a digital speedometer. And on here, you can also see your drive selection, temperature, and the odometer, 57948. Moving over, you can see your navigation. This will show turn-by-turn -turn information if you are currently navigating instead of the compass. Audio information, some nice service info like your tire pressure, and a service reminder you can set for yourself. We set our customers for 3,000 miles. Then you got settings in here. You can go and customize here. You got the door. You have a nice feature on here called Smart Lift Gate, where you can just approach the hatch with your key fob. No kicks, no buttons, no presses. Just stay nearby. When you've been away from the vehicle and it's locked, it'll open automatically for you. Totally hands-free. Love that feature. That's why I like to show it off in here. So. Uh, Left-hand wand is going to control blinkers, brights, and headlights for you. They are automatic headlights. Right-hand wand will control your front and rear wipers for you. We can see the vehicle is pushed to start. Up above, you've got some nice interior lighting. It's going to be front and rear for you. You have a sunglass holder right here. An auto-dimming rearview mirror with a compass. Your blue link controls are going to be right here for you and home link garage controls. So, this is going to give you remote services directly to your phone, and that's how you get the remote start on this type of vehicle and a lot of other cool features. Um, and then when you have Apple CarPlay or Android Auto connected, once we get to the entertainment system, this will take you directly to navigation. You've got emergency, and you can call Blue Link directly to get some assistance too. Uh, down below here, we're going to have a nice entertainment system with some vents included. Uh, here's your home screen showing your date and time with your preferred applications. If we go to look at everything, you can see you've got access to your radio, music, images, the auxiliary port. You have different media sources you can select. Uh, you can remove or download these. Uh, checking your navigation and current location, your phone. You've also got uh, your Blue Link, Quick Guide for the Vehicle, Sirius XM, Voice Command as well. It looks like, wow, okay, so uh, forgive me, folks. Learning moment for us. The 2016 Tucson does not come with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Let's just double check. Yep. Wow. Interesting. Okay. Good to know. Good to know, guys. Not included in the 2016 model. So I misquoted on what this feature does right here for you. Gotcha. So 
Um, on this model, this is just going to use your Blue Link Navigation Services. Okay, good to know. Got analog controls for everything right down here. And then a nice dual climate automatic temperature control system. We're going to get this to 73. You hear those vents automatically slow down. You've got heated seats up front right here. And then a nice power center, 212 volts with a USB and auxiliary port. Some great storage down here, as well as here and over here. Uh, your shifter is automatic, of course. You've got park, reverse, neutral drive, and some manual shifting capability. Here is your backup camera, by the way. Blue line or box showing you where the Tucson is at in real time, and then the projected pathing path here showing you where you're going to be traveling to. Okay, um, This is the true sides of your vehicle, so as long as nothing is in between, uh, you will not impact with anything. So if I want to turn more aggressively, I'm going to go right back into this spot where I pulled the Tucson out of. Manual shifting capabilities right here, and then you've got your drive modes you can select. You've got Eco, Sport, and your normal driving mode, as well as a downhill descent control for the vehicle. So uh, what that's going to do is just help maintain a certain speed if you're flying downhill to take wear and tear off of your pads and rotors by having the Tucson utilize the transmission and its gears in downshifting slightly. So that's how engine braking kind of works. Uh, more storage right here. And then a nice deep center console. Glove box, also spacious. Has your owner's manuals all inside. All right. And then the visor has this nice little card holder here. Another one here, mirrored, independently lit, and it's also telescopic for you too. So let's go ahead and check out our back seats, the hatch, and our passenger seat adjustability on this model. What do you say? All right. So back here, more storage in the doors. We've got our back seats with cargo nets, rear ventilation. And then the rear seats have a nice armrest here for you with cup holders, as well as a latch system for child seating. Rear seats have the ability to fold down and recline. You can see you've got some good adjustability right there with the seat lean back. And then these also fold right on down for you in a 60-40 split. Got your front floor mats back here, and the Hyundai First Aid kit. Um, this does come with Velcro and some sticky pads, so you can reinstall this if you do want to put it somewhere else. You can see right there, this other one is actually kind of coming off, so um, it's really not applied too well to this particular surface. So, um, but you can see we've also got a nice cargo mat, 12 volt outlet back here as well. It's, um, Lighting. And you can actually lift this up right here. You see you have a cargo net down here, as well as your roadside tools and a spare tire. Now, um, this uh, board actually can receive further instant forward. You can see there's another channel for it to slide onto. Uh, I don't want to demonstrate on thi at this particular instance just because I have all these extra items here. So. But um, you know what? I'm going to do it anyways. Just slide it. This will ride, ride right on down. I don't know why I uh, made it seem like it was going to be super difficult. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so super easy. You can just do this all with one hand very carefully. Uh, come on. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about, folks. You're welcome. So, and a nice rear bumper applique right here. Cargo transfer. Okay. And just moving on to the passenger seat. Uh, you've also got keyless entry on here on the passenger front door. Got some power adjustability. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight way adjustable as well. Just no lumbar support. And a nice little storage cubby right there on the right hand side. Hey guys, that's going to wrap it up for this beautiful Ruby Wine 2016 Hyundai Tucson Limited. If you'd like any more information on this vehicle, pricing, purchase options, head on over to McCarthyHyundai.com. Make sure you like and share this video with your friends and family. Comments if you have any compliments, questions, or corrections about any of the information I've provided to you today. And most importantly, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you can stay up to date with all of the vehicles we're uploading to this channel for your informational and shopping needs. This is Matt Croissant over at McCarthy Hyundai Blue Springs. Thanks so much again for your time. I hope you're having a wonderful day.